Hello, what's going on? And welcome to my first official FIBA 23 Ultimate Team video. And I thought I'd chuck on 12,000 FIBA points so you don't have to. We're going to find out today if the pack weight is good or bad this year. And tomorrow at half two, check your sub box because the RTG is also starting. So if you're ready for that, thumbs up. Get ready and let's go. So you know the deal. Let's get started. 12,000 FIBA points. First ever pack on Ultimate Team. And this account will be used for extra content at like 10 p.m. I'll have some bonus uploads. I don't know. Paqueta. We could have signed him. Well, he hasn't even looked that great, to be honest, in the Premier League. But Lucas Paqueta, first ever pack. Brazilian flair. Brazilian skill. A lot of players, to be fair. Oh, not this. If we don't see a walkout in 12,000 fear points, I'm not putting any more on ever again. Well, that's a lie. But I will not be spending as much this year. Roberto Firmino, 83. Yeah, another Brazilian. But I'm not going to be spending as much this year. No way. I'm going to be running, really, the main, which is the RTG. But even if we were to pack walkouts, just some investments that I can use, well, the price ranges on those cards are screwed. Like, Lukaku is about 50, 60,000. No one's going to buy him. And that's been the issue for a lot of those high-rated cards. Onostal is actually going to use him in my Bundesliga starter team or German starter team. A thousand coins, Arsenal badge, even this stuff will sell. But wow, we're off to a slow start, I must say. Come on, EA. It's the start of a new FIFA. I've got 10,900 points remaining. Or 100 I transferred. Oh, by the way, if you're wondering, like, Fuj, can you transfer FIFA points? Mitro, can you transfer FIFA points? Yes, you can. It gave me that prompt straight away. So that's something you guys might want to do. Canes, no way, boys. Flashback. The Silver Kane, 66 rated or 69 rated on FIFA 13. God, I loved him. He was so OP. I used to beat some like Team of the Year squads. Or like the equivalent of Team of the Year squads back then. Polish. Goalkeeper. Flappy Hansky. My goodness me, I know there's not many special cards on the game. But these ratings are awfully low, EA. I'm just going to be chilling until something flashes up. Like I can't tell what, what a walkout is. Marega. What? 77? Nah, these are some great value packs, I must say. How much are they, like, each one? Like, a pound 50? My goodness me. We're burning money. We're setting money on fire at this rate. Another 150 FIFA points pack. This is why you shouldn't really spend. Or should you? Oh, that's not bad. David Silva's lost his overall. He's going to be using so many SBC solutions. I mean, he was last year, but even more so now, he's 83. He's going to be like the best one to buy, for real. Any walkouts for me, EA? Brazilian? Brazilian striker! <laughs> Gabriel Jesus. He's going to sell for something, boys. Like 9,000 plus when the game comes out. He might demand a little bit more value. 10,000? That's a good pull. I'd probably use him myself, though. Test him in like a cheap budget Premier League side. Do you want to see that as an upload like late night tomorrow? I think I'd do that. Sheffield United badge. Yeah, it's all good. But Gabriel Jesus, I like that. Next one, though. I mean, I would actually be a little bit disappointed if Jesus was the best player overall in 12,000s. Just one more count, I'll be happy. Portuguese, no way. I'm being, I'm being told, though, that Ronaldo is OP. And with these new power shots like LBRB, they are flying to the back of the net. Yelson Martins, though, sweet. 77 rated, my goat. No, he is my goat. He doesn't really look that good, though. Daddy, Deadly Blinds, not bad. Okay, okay. But from what I've seen, the new features do look sick. Like being able to take long shots outside the box consistently if you hit those power strikes properly. Our God damn, is he still good? Not really. He's dropped off slightly. 83 dribbling. Not really that pace that you desire in the midfields. Jose Perez, what's happened to him? Like what's happened to Leicester in general? But is Jose Perez still playing well, Leicester fans? An hour, I'll sell him. Well, sell everything. Crystal Palace, just sell absolutely everything. But like I mentioned, stuff that they've added to the game doesn't really seem like gimmicky. It does look really good. So I'm so looking forward to trying it. I'm being told as well that the AI box are less effective. Or block, sorry. Uh, I'll say Chamberlain, 77. Yeah, I mean, his car looks the same every single year. 80 pace, 81 dribbling. Not bad. Brazilian center forward. It's not Firmino again. Oh, no. Oh, it's going to give me a duplicate already. Taliska. Doesn't look bad. Has he still got his five-star weak foot? 
No, he doesn't. Four star, four star, maybe a promo that they're boosted up again. Other, other than that, he still looks good. I think anyway. Australia. Tifo? No, I don't want Australia Tifo. Some people still feel like I'm from Australia or South Africa. I, I, I don't know. Maybe my voice is a little bit funny. Well, I am from the UK. I can assure you. Uh, no, sorry. I'm New Zealand today. I've, I've taken the trip to New Zealand so I can gain access to the game a little bit earlier. Uh, I do have a second home in New Zealand. Loto Mamba? No, 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 no. Uh, Imba, sorry. I don't really know how to say his name. EA. Still, oh Christ, I need to push my monitor over. Still no walkout. Cam, can I get Foden or something at Madison? I'm pretty sure that Newcastle, my supported club, are really pushing in for him uh, when the window opens again or reopens yet. Norton and Freus, well, they've signed about 50 players. My first official FIFA 23 video and my recording is going crazy. I had to restart everything, so I'm not sure how many FIFA points we have remaining. But we've got a CDM here and Guisa. Now, I thought he was going to be really, really OP, and he probably still is, but his work rates are a little bit sketchy. Look at this. Medium low. For a CDM, I'd rather like medium, medium or medium high. You know the deal. Just a standard, but medium low, so he doesn't even want to track back when we're getting caught. I don't know if that's a good idea, but Anguissa, he should be a solid option just for the first few games, right? Until you can find flaws with your team. But how do you tell if it's a walkout? Hang on, I've got glows. Oh no, I thought something was shining at the bottom. Fernando 83? No, this is mad. Not one walkout for me. Oh, 3,000 coins. I mean, I'll take it. But come on, I think you can do better. We are down to 7,600. And we're getting non rares. No, I'm about to quit now. No, we're too far in. Water Peters? I think he's OP. Whenever I've seen Water Peters play, he's very, very good for Southampton. Someone's just subscribed. And I'm not even live. <laughs> Delict. 85. Oh, you made me miss it. Technically, that's like a walkout. No. Christensen as well. That's technically a walkout. Delict. 85 rated. Good well-rounded stats there. I reckon quite a few people would want to use him. And then Dutch in the Bundesliga. That might help some really nice hybrids. It's a rare. It's Brazilian. Oh, Rodrigo. Do you know what, right? If we don't get a walkout, I'll take someone like Usman Dembele, who's going to be like 40, 50,000, or Nkunku, something like that. Well, of course, I'll take Nkunku. I think he's pushing up to like 80,000. And you're going to see a market increase around 5 p.m., 6 p.m. tonight, especially when people get back from school, get back from work, and they might be using the trick of maybe getting the game early. The market is going to be flooded. And more coins are obviously going to be added to the game. So maybe the lower rated cards will go down. And then the high rated meta cards will really boom. Perez, Torore. Hey, I like the kit. That's nice. Red and black. I don't even know what theme I'm going to go for with the RTG. Do I want to keep it like red and blue like I usually do? Uh, what badge do I use? Because I did stick with it. I asked you like what badge do you want to see? And as soon as I apply one, I never really change it. Last year, I think we were using the Newcastle badge, but I might switch up for this year. Lingard, has he really been playing that well? Nottingham Forest, do you think they're going to go down? Do you think Nottingham Forest are going to get relegated? Do they have enough to stay in the Premier League? Probably not. I can't see it. Bournemouth, Nottingham Forest, and to go down. Well, and isn't even a club, but who do you think? 6,200, I think I saw. 6,250 remaining. Serbian striker, Vlaovic. He's been hitting some banging free kicks lately. Vlaovic ain't a bad one to try out. What I am going to be doing though, like I explained a little bit earlier, I do want to go through the leagues and build some like cheap OP sides that I can put out on YouTube and just test out the cards that maybe you guys are going to be buying, especially when you just get the game. Like, There's no more point me telling you that, oh yeah, CR7, go and check him out. Well, who's got the coins for CR7? Even though I don't think he's going to be as expensive or definitely not ex as expensive as previous years. But you get what I mean. I'm going to look for the OP players like Muriel, Correa. Well, it doesn't have to be like Syria. Who's this? Striker Daka? He looks okay. See, I don't know. I haven't really properly played the game yet. I'm not sure what it requires. Like, what is the meta? Do you still need, like, the agile type players? Do you need a little bit more strength? And we'll fight up the top, running in behind. I really don't know. But we have 5,950 remaining. And I've got nothing. 
I've actually got nothing for that. Centre back, don't you dare give me Maguire. Actually, I, I think Maguire's like 81 rated. I'll take that at this point. Darlow, always believe in Cole Darlow. Nah, he's not very good. He really isn't. He makes a few too many mistakes. Against Tranmere Rovers, though, when he was playing, uh, a couple of injuries. Like, they should have had like four or five players being sent off. Dirty squad. It's a patter just to bring that strength. Maybe he'll be useful in my Serie A builds. We've got Nut. Well, that's not even his name. Non-rare left wing, and it's from Ajax or Campos. Wow, for an 81 non-rare, his stats look a lot better than what I've been packing. But then again, he's always had that awkwardness with his height, like six foot two. Not many people don't want to use him. Lamptey, yo, this Lamptey looks 49 physical. Damn, a gust of wind and he's gone. Wow, that's really bad. I was liking the look of his pace and just like he really did look like OP. But no way would I be using that. God, no. Way too weak. Can I have a walkout? Belgium goalkeeper or Courtois or something? Castils? That's basically the cheap version of him. Me as well. Oh, my first player pick, 75 to 80. He's already had a rating cap. Trossard, this card here. Look at him. Look at this card. Four star, four star. Those stats, though. Really nice acceleration, which could be important. Outside the foot flare. Very good dribbling. Oh, you know what I do like this year? The fact that they've grayed out like the lower stats and they're trying to highlight the key ones. We haven't got anything. Non rares. More non-rares. I know who that is. Igalo. Ian Acho. <laughs> this is the worst pack opening. Martins Indy. Is that the guy with the big eyes? You know, uh, the World Cup or something? I swear that's Martins Indy. No, I'm actually going to get a refund. Maybe I'll have to put together just literally like a 10k team. Vitzel, 34 pace. 34. What's happened to him? Is he walking around in crutches? From 77 to 34. Tomiyasu. From last year's picture. Tomiyasu. Tomiyasu. Oh, man. I don't know. Something about Tomiyasu just makes me happy. I think he's actually a good player. He seems like a nice guy. Tomiyasu. For real, though. That's not going to be good. There's no insane player that's from uh, Chicka's Republic. Barak. No, thank you. We've got... I thought I said Hendrix. The Chicken Sendies. Oh, uh, go on then. Yeah, I'll have that. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to do. But I am desperate right now. Is that Jekko? It's Edin Jekko. He's a rare. 84 as well. Has he gone up then? He was an 83 non-rare last year. That's deserved, man. He has so much technical quality and is finishing laser, laser shots from Edin Dzeko. That is a fully deserved upgrade if he has... Uh, been given one i think his dribbling should be boosted his close control is like underrated him and olivier juru are still like old but gold all right we have got a rare though center mid ericsson oh that's not very good 88 passing though key stat but that's not very good i did say that i would never spend any more field points again so ea hopefully you're hearing me right now last one it could be. It could be. Fringe? Cinnamon? No, give me more. Cochlin. Wow, boys. Wow. What do you think of that? Do you think that's worth the money that we spend? Probably, actually. In terms of, like, value at the start of the game, like, everything really does sell or has some value. But I am absolutely shocked that we haven't had, like, even an 86 for the card. I'm, I'm really disappointed. The pack weight seems even worse this year than it did last year. So please, boys, do not believe for a second. Oh, hang on a minute. I might get a walk out here. E oh, no. It's a non-rare. 70, 78, 79. Jesus, man. Not even a walk out from this. Mendy, boys. Does that count? Technically, that is a walk out, Mendy. Like I say, like even a Mendy or something. 86 to 90 once again. Some special cards that we can use in like some friendlies. If you guys want to like play against me as well, jump into the stream. Come and uh, have some games against me. Navas. Not not bad. And the last one, 81 to 85. Do you think it's going to be an OP card? Because for real, like I'm looking for this stuff so I can produce content. 
What a way to end it. Nick Pope. We've been poped. EA Sports, I'm not happy, but thank you very much for watching, boys. Drop a thumbs up if you've enjoyed, and I will see you tomorrow for the ultimate RTG. Take care. Team out. Peace.